was planning to do a little beauty vlog. My cousin booked us a spa at Sarazu. So after we eat the toast, we're gonna go to the spa. Got an ice latte. I love how there's so much vegetables in here. So I got a haircut yesterday at Park Jun. I definitely need to style it um, for it to look good. But they cut off like 10 inches because the bottom part was really damaged. My hair feels so much healthier now. Now we are heading to the spa and we are walking over to Myeongdong. So we are inside the Lotte Hotel and it looks so nice. Moisturizing and comforting treatment. This is our welcome drink. I just left for a little bit because our appointments are at two different times. My husband's going first, and I have to be back within an hour and a half. Here are so much more cutesy. Orange vanilla cake and an Earl Grey scone. They can turn it. I am doing some damage right now. I just got a drink and I found a spot. I'm gonna eat my scone. I got a mango smoothie. Oh my god, this is so good. The orange cake is for my husband, and then I got an Earl Grey scone. Looking for a scarf for my niece. This is so cute. They have the cutest designs in Korea. This is cute too. Okay, I got a foundation. 
kitchen for my mom. All right, I had to get out of there. I was not even planning to buy anything. Okay, it's almost time for my spa, so I'm heading back to the hotel. the powder room my skin feels so clean I ordered the Pyongyang naengmyeon and this is kind of like a North Korean style naengmyeon it's my first time trying it So one of the main reasons why I came to Korea was because I wanted to get LASIK eye surgery. I had been wanting LASIK for a really long time and I just kept putting it off. First off, it is surgery and also it's a big investment. I have been wearing glasses and contacts for like half of my life and it actually adds up a lot when you are constantly buying contact lenses, solution, like glasses, doing eye exams. So Korea is known to be really good at medical procedures and it costs way less than it does in the US. I did a ton of research back at home and I found BGSS on YouTube. BGSS is a really famous eye clinic in South Korea. They've been around for many, many years and gotten a lot of awards. I also learned about the different types of surgery such as LASIK, PRK, and smile surgery. I ended up going with the smile eye surgery because it's the least invasive and also the recovery time is supposed to be really short which is perfect for people like me that are just visiting Korea. So yeah, I just thought it was definitely time for me to take action and get it done. Anyways, I just wanted to share with you guys a little bit about the process and also my experience with getting smile eye surgery. I was able to film a lot of it except for obviously the surgery but yeah, I will share with you guys a little bit about how my experience went We checked in at BGSS in Akujang before 9am and put our stuff away in the locker room The first thing they did was give us mouthwash to rinse our mouth They gave us a tour of the facility and we learned about the history of the eye center They have been around for 27 years and have won many awards Then we began our initial testing we did a DNA test and multiple rounds of eye examinations to determine any issues using their equipment. I'm not gonna lie, I was pretty nervous going into this, but they made me feel very relaxed and reassured. They were really thorough and they even had different practitioners conduct the same test for accurate results. I felt that the entire process was very efficient and organized. Basically, the tests were to determine if we were qualified candidates for the smile eye surgery, and thankfully, we were. Devin, our translator, walked us through the surgical procedure for smile surgery and the main differences with LASIK and PRK. She explained everything very clearly and it was super easy to understand. Our last consultation was with Dr. Lee Jae Myung, and we were given the green light to go with Zai Smile Pro. We got surgery at 4.30 p.m. that day, and the entire procedure took only about 30 minutes. That's me after surgery. The taxi driver thought I was crazy. Follow-up was two days later. Everything was good to go. It was a little blurry the next several days, but my eyesight got better each day. Currently, this is 2016. It's perfect. I highly recommend BGSS for eye surgery for anyone needing eye correction. If you're a foreigner, make sure to ask for Devin. She is so amazing and so kind. I cannot believe I don't need these anymore. All of this has been in my life for over a decade and I can finally say goodbye. Just got out of the shower. I honestly don't know how I feel about my hair. I've been putting three layers of this ample and it's really been helping with the dryness. My skin is 
skin feels extra dry, so I'm gonna put a face mask on. There's a lot that comes out. And then you just put it on your neck or your body or your, your face. Something else I try to do when I have a face mask on is use this guasha. It's been about three days since I got the smile LASIK surgery. I keep thinking that I still have contacts in my eyes. It's definitely going to take some time to get used to, but I still can't believe that I could see now. It's seriously such a blessing to be able to see. My glasses are probably like seven years old. I immediately threw out my glasses and all the contacts. I'm so grateful and happy that I got to do it. Probably one of the biggest investments I'm making for myself. Oh my god, guys, it's hailing! <laughs> this is the place that Devin from BGSS recommended, so we're giving it a try. Wow, it looks so good. I actually wanted to try like this hot pot rice. We just, we just ordered these two bestsellers. This one is the steak and it comes in a set. <laughs> this one is the sea bream fish. You're supposed to put some sauce in here and mix it and then put it in the bowl. And then afterwards you put this broth into the hot pot and then it makes the durunchi. I saw that this place is known to have one of the best salt breads.
always get this. Clear Super Proof Mascara. This is one of my favorite brand, Aromatica. If you're at Olivia, you have to get a face mask. This is one of my favorite. And the Dr. Jart is really good too. I recently tried this one and this one was really hydrating. Mediheal masks are my favorites, especially the collagen and also the watermide. This is the supplement section and I actually tried this for a few days. It's like a collagen shot, but it tastes so good. It tastes like peach, but I'm gonna try another box of this. There's also healthy diet snacks. They're actually pretty good. I just got back to the hotel. Olive Young was having a huge sale today, so I got a few things from there. This is a Tude House Dr. Mascara Fixer. It's just a really good fixer before you put your mascara on. I have really straight lashes, so this really helps to keep my lashes curled for a long time. After I put the fixer on, I always go with mascara. This is from Clio Kill Lash Super Proof Mascara. And I always get the volume curling. They were having a one plus one, so I got both of these for the price of one. Next is a Roman Dewy Full Water Tint. This is the color Canyon. This is my second bottle, and this is one of my favorite lip gloss. It's a really natural color, which is why I like it, but it also gives a nice gloss. I ran out of serum, so I just purchased this because it was on sale. I actually bought this a few days ago from Olive Young, and I used a little bit, as you can see. I really like this. It's like a water texture. I like to layer this on at least like two to three times, and it's really hydrating. Next is the Neogen Exfoliator. I used to use this a few years back. I thought it got discontinued, so I stopped using it but I saw it at Olive Young. This was one of the best exfoliators that I've used in the past, so I got another one. And of course, if you go to Olive Young, you have to get their face mask. I always stock up on these whenever it's on sale. Mediheal makes one of the best face masks in my opinion. And lastly, I got this. This is the Vital Beauty Super Collagen. I already finished a whole pack of this when I first arrived to Korea. It's really convenient because you just pop it in your purse and you can just drink it on the go. It tastes like the peach jellies that you get in like convenience stores, but it tastes really good. It's probably the best collagen I've ever tasted. I just wish that it wasn't so expensive. But yeah, anyways, that was my haul for Olive Young. Today was a really long day, so I'm gonna wash up and hit the bed. <laughs>